this is a sniffer. One of the weakest mobs in Minecraft. But using one simple glitch, I turned him into the deadliest mob who's completely immortal. Because it first started when I joined the server. Yo, where am I? Quip, you're late to the pet competition. What do you mean late? I'm on time. Don't argue with me. You're late, all right? So you get last pick of all the mobs. Okay, but first of all, why am I actually here though? Uh, no questions, buddy. Whoa, whoa. Yo, I have another double G with. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, this man. What is this? Oh my. Oh, wait, lava? Wait, I'm falling, I'm falling, I'm falling into the void. No, the nether roof. Oh, whoa, that was last minute thinking. Choose your pet. We have four hearts for a sniffer, 10 hearts for nothing. I think this was taken. And 40 hearts for the warden. Now the obvious choice is the warden, but I'm currently on four hearts, so I might have to choose the sniffer. And yeah, I think this guy's kind of useless. If I right click, okay, and you have chosen the sniffer. The egg is currently hidden and you must find it. But I think there's a different problem right now. They've currently trapped me on the nether roof and are keeping my pet hostage, meaning they want me disqualified. Well, I have lava. Am I able to light the pool with lava? Yeah, I don't think this is gonna work. But if the pool's disabled, how did they escape? Just so I don't lose where I am, I'm gonna leave signs. But there seems to be nothing but void in the nether. But where did you spawn from? Is there a hole somewhere I don't know about? Or he must have spawned in the nether rack. Either way, I have gold and I can actually trade with you. So take that. Because through the piglin, I'm able to get fire charges. And then I can light up the pool. This might be a very smart idea, but the lava should burn the sign. In the meantime, is anything from here and i got a fire charge which means i can just take this back and just light up the portal and now if i go through here oh, i'm so smart how have i ended up back here it turns out the nether pool was trapped infinitely spawning on the nether roof and i didn't get another fire charge so if this pool is linked to that pool and i infinitely keep spawning between both of them maybe i take this obsidian and run far away because now that I'm in the new biome, I can make this pool, which will be hopefully my escape from the nether roof. But I don't have any more fire charges. But I managed to get netherrack. And if I place the netherrack down, there's a small chance a ghast will spawn. And I need to kind of wait with that. But I managed to pick up the carpet. And even though it's moss carpet, I think it's flammable. So if I can place a lava like that, maybe it'll catch on fire. Hey, yo, where did you spawn from though? That's worse than a ghast because the skeleton has the power to one shot me, which will make me lose my last heart. He needs to keep coming towards me. Okay, this is risky. He needs to shoot for the love to light up the moss carpet. Just shoot it. Yo, he shot it. If it burns, this could work. I didn't lit. Yeah, you're an idiot. You helped me escape. And this time I'm actually out. I now had to find out where the girls were holding my egg hostage. So I could take it back and win the competition. The location points to there. And is that two netherite guards? All right, Toby, we have one job, bro. All right, we just gotta guard the sniffer egg. Yeah, I don't really know how I'm gonna do this. Because I need to make my way inside that location to take my sniffer egg back. Yeah. Yeah, they really don't seem to be leaving, though. Easiest yeah. security job in the world, man. Which means the temple's heavily guarded. And there's no way for me to enter. So for now, I'm gonna kind of back away. But wait a second, what is that? Well, right now, I have no loot. So the best chance of me obtaining my sniffer is to become stacked. Yo, what is this? Hey, Quiv. I was not expecting to see you here. Yo, what's down here? Yo, Yo. don't look in there yet. Don't look in there yet. Wait, what do you mean? You, you can win a netherite sword if you MLG. That actually sounds good. Wait, what do I need to pay, though? I'm kind of broke. Nothing. It's free. Wait, seriously? 100% free. Okay, wait, how deep is this actual thing, though? It's thing, pretty though. deep. Whoa! Yo! Ah! Yo! Oh! Wait! Oh my! No way! What was that? Yo, they tried to kill me! The girls were breaking the rules, doing anything to create the best pet, even if it meant killing me. But once I reached the top, no one was there. Aves, you here? Well, she's left the sword, which is good, but it's literally only on breaking free, so it doesn't help. I kind of don't need this sword right now, but maybe I can sell this sword for something that would help me get my sniffer. I kind of like the new cherry trees. Let me first take all this wood. And that's why I'm inside my shop. But maybe I made it a little too close. Because if they've seen I've escaped, they'll try to kill me. Oh, hey, Quiff. Okay, you kind of scared me. Uh, I'm, I'm actually just selling this netherite sword. Uh, I don't have any money. But you have a camel. Yo, take this. Give me the camel. <gasps> okay. N nice doing business with you. Bye. You are gonna help me. Now I have a new pet, but it's not the one I'm allowed to use. But now I'm on single player with the two new Minecraft 1.20 mobs. The camel and the sniffer. And each one doesn't attack. But if I grab a poisonous potato... A simple bug where they'll actually attack me this time. And yeah, like I thought, I don't know what it is, but if I hold a poisonous potato, they just start attacking. And the same thing goes with a camel, meaning I can create a camel that attacks. And like I thought, I don't have a single poisonous potato, meaning I need to find a way to get a hundred, otherwise my plan won't work. And I think farming won't really work. I might as get nine, but that's too slow. So new plan. If I can find a cherry blossom biome, which is right here. Yo, this biome looks pretty cool. And there's a lot of flatland for my plan. That's because 
I'm gonna make an arcade machine, trading my last heart for everyone's poisonous potato. Welcome to my arcade machine. This is where they'll be playing for my last heart. So let me get it out of my ender chest. I'm kind of sad, but it's literally for the greater good. Now, any minute they're gonna stumble across the cherry biome and see my giant box. I already see name tags. Uh, hello? Wait, Kimberly! No, 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 Wait a second, wait a second, wait a second, nope. Listen, there's, uh, there's no need to do this, man. Uh, okay, yeah, no, I was just, I was about to go AFK, but, uh, yeah. Right, that's what you were doing. No, I know, you st uh, still got no sniffer? No pet? I do have a heart right here. Yeah, what's stopping me from just, uh, taking it? Okay, no, 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 listen, listen. Whoa, Yo, wait, whoa, hey, that, that, hey, that, was actually, that, me, that was accidental, that was accidental, that was like, listen, listen, listen. All I want is poisonous potatoes, and you can actually take this heart. I don't have any poisonous potatoes. I actually do. Uh, how many do you have? 32. All I do is I click this, and there we go. It's off. Land on the diamond. Uh, Come on. Yeah, wait. see. Oh, scam. All right. No, we're going again. Wait, wait. No, you didn't pay. You know what? We're taking it anyways. Thank you. No. What are you going to do about it, huh? Yo, they're just they're evil. But they walked into my plan. I have poisonous potatoes. So who's the real winner? Now I just need to head back to my camel. Who's right there? Okay, you know, I'm going to throw the poisonous potatoes there for now. You're going to be the ultimate distraction because you're a bugged mob. I'm going to send a minecart with the poisonous potatoes to the people guarding my egg. And once they take it from the chest, they the camel will attack them. And when they're completely confused, that's my only chance to sneak in. But there's a lot of girls still on the server. And if they call for backup, I'll be caught. And I kind of don't want to do this, but you see that dragon egg right there? Yeah, I'm kind of going to steal it. This is the only dragon egg on the server. People will realize it's missing and search the entire spawn to try and find it. And that's why I'm going to kind of frame small. I'm just going to place it right here. And just like that, small was the culprit. The dragon egg has been what? stolen? What? And yeah, everyone's freaking out in chat. No, no, no. What? That doesn't make any sense. What? Small stole the dragon egg? Small stole the dragon Small? egg? Which means Aves has definitely found the bait. I'm sending back up. And Kipley's sending back up, which means the distraction worked. And this was the perfect time to strike. I'm in invis. Hopefully Toby and Echo and Aves get the egg back. Kipley's only one there, which means two guards are currently down. I have two minutes of invis, so I gotta be fast. I just put these here. Add more rails. Inside the chest, I'll put the poisonous potatoes. Is that minecart moving? She's investigating! This doesn't make any sense! Which means I just need to bring this close enough. The camel's off! I need to be fast. I need to be fast. Hello, Camo. What on earth? Oh, you're so cute! My invis run out! Are you hitting me right now? Is it because I'm holding potatoes? Yo, 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 it's perfect. Down, boy, down! Whoa, whoa! But now I'm gonna block this off so she won't realize. So now I have a limited amount of time before she'll kill the camel and check up on the egg. My sniffer egg right there. But hey, yo, what is this? It's around a circular barrier. Circle in Minecraft? Bro, what is going on? But I'm not able to go inside. How is that allowed? Is there anything inside here that would help me? I never expected my egg to be fully protected. And if I can't find a way inside, the entire plan will fail. Wait, why is my hand blue? What is going on? Why are you taking no damage? Oh! I can make a boat. Wait, it's not letting me into the boat. I can't hop into the boat because the magma's pulling it down. Meaning they were prepared for me to try and steal it. Okay, think. What else is here? I can actually use more wood. But what if I make a raft? Use this to go inside? Let me actually make some blocks. Wait, how did you spawn? My egg just hatched. Oh, wait, this might be a problem. First of all, I'm going to break this so you don't die. But what do I do now? Before, I could have just stolen the egg and escaped. But now I need to escape with my sniffer. Kippy can arrive at any second. Okay, this looks so cool. I I think I might need to break this. You've reached the edge of the world, but he didn't get TP'd back, which kind of means... Where have I got TP'd? Wait, this is kind of a bad idea. How do I get back down? Since I'm on top of the building, I'll be easily spotted. But wait a second. If I make a crafting table, then I make another raft. I place it here. I was just out. I was just out. How did it put me back in? Wait, yo, I've just got some OP loot. This elytra might work. I was just... Wait, it just let me glitch out easily. Oh my way, that was so easy. And he's right here. Yo, I'm so smart. And now you've kind of got to come with me. Why is he so slow? But even if I've just got my sniffer, he's still one of the weakest mobs in Minecraft and would lose any sort of 1v1. Well, it seems like my sniffer grew, but I'm going to put you right here. Just stay there for a second. Right now, I have no loot and I'm on one heart. So to make my sniffer strong, I first need to hire a player. Echo, are you at home? Uh, yeah. I need to hire you right now. What are you offering? I have one of the free elytras right here. Take it and I need you to steal items from Kipley's house. Got it. The sniffer 
Sniffrag, it's gone! There's a crafting table! They've said the Sniffrag is gone. Who was it? Well, this is perfect. Since Kippy is completely distracted with the Sniffrag, Echo will have an easy time stealing all the netherite. Yeah, no, you're kind of wrong. Because Kipling lives in one of the most protected Minecraft bases. And I want Echo to be caught. Because now, since he's left his house, I found his bed. This is kind of where the obsidian's gonna come in. And voila, the trap's been made. Well, if I put the dispenser right here and some poisonous potatoes, when he respawns, he's gonna walk over that pressure plate. And that's why my sniffer's also gonna be trapped in here. What are I you doing? Uh, you killed my skeletons! You're breaking I into my explain. base! I'm right about time. Kipling just said she knows it was me. Come out and face me like a man. Which means Echo's been caught. Cool. This means my bait worked. And most of the players want to kill me. Which means they'll easily fall for my trap. Well, good thing I stole this brush from Echo. Because I'm going to dig up a new sniffer egg. And use that as bait. Making them believe it's actually mine. Okay, boom. Found it. Now, what are you going to give me? Is this a candle? Oh, okay. This might take a long time. I really got yellow dye. It just gave me a sniffer egg. I got what I needed. Meaning, now I could work on my trap. And what better place than Abe's little trap machine? First, I need to hash this guy. And if you didn't know, sniffers actually hatch faster on moss. In the meantime, I have this shovel, which I can use just to mine this out. All right, Echo, does this place look familiar at all, huh? And like that, it's done. Well, for this to work, I need to add the lava everywhere. I really hope I brought enough lava. Where's the sniffer egg? I actually have enough. Well, let me get rid of all the evidence. Oh, I kind of needed one bucket. Oh, it doesn't matter. It's okay, I don't care if you have to break the whole house down. I want you to find the sniffer egg. I'm now going to add signs. And it's completely done. I then cover the floor in moss. And now wait for my sniffer to crack. Because it's slowly getting there. Break the whole house down if we have to. Oh, and it just spawned. I hate to do this to you, but... Oh my, why these look so funny? But I'm kind of trapping you here. Kipley must have searched every house by now. Still having no idea where I was. Which means it's kind of risky. But if I go over to Kipley's base... Like what I said, this is this is the most protected base ever. I'm going to write the code. And say quiff sniffer pet. I'll literally just place it right here. And kind of leave. Because any second now, she'll head back to her house. You said something else was here. I don't know why you were by my house again. But it looks like you were right. And I'm low-key back in time. Now, this is going to be risky. Because they'll be coming from that direction. And if they just see the sniff on top of this moss carpet, they'll be extremely sus. But that's why I have this Invis potion. It's got cords in it. And it's labeled Quiff Sniffer Pet. When they get close enough, I'm going to splash us all with Invis. So they'll have no idea where I am. I think I see them right there. Okay, we should almost be at the cords, Echo. Keep your eye out, all right? Okay, this is risky. I'm on one heart. This is very sus. Okay, we go together. And then we kill Quiff, okay? Quiff! What? Where did he go? Oh. Don't hit the sniffer! Oh, no. Oh! No! Yo! Get me out of here! Don't you have a water Yo, bucket? Wait. Get me out of here! Don't you have a water bucket? Oh, my! Yo! I'm so small! Well, first, let me just actually turn this all into cobblestone obsidian. And look at this armor! That kind of worked out perfectly. Which means right now, Echo should be with my sniffer. Yo, he's dying to the sniffer! Oh, yeah, this is perfect. And he spawns on it! Yo, this is so small! The sniffer's just gonna keep killing you. What did I do to deserve this? Yeah. Yeah, that's just kind of lucky. Oh, well, he's dead. Well, that kind of worked. Meaning right now, my sniffer should have taken all his hearts. Making him a lot stronger. Now, I kind of want to test this. One, two... Three, four. He's already got more health than he usually does. Which means this kind of work. But we only have two more hours until the pet competition. And he needs to be a lot stronger. Which is why I'm going to sell him. And all right, selling my OP sniffer. Well, there's something you didn't know about. He gave me torch flower seeds. But a player has currently been hoarding a lot of netherite. And his base is very protected. And that's where another bug of yours comes in. Because did you know if you shift inside a sniffer, it crashes your game. So I'm going to lure him into buying my sniffer. Only for him to crash. Which would be the perfect moment to steal all these loot. Everyone is looking at you. Oh, my! Oh, no, 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 Listen, listen, listen. You see the sniffer? Yeah. You can buy it off me. I could uh, just take it. He's a, he's an immortal sniffer. Yeah, yeah. He's he don't die. Shift inside and you can ride him. <laughs> he just crashed. Yo, 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 perfect timing. I need to rush. I need to rush. I need to rush. With him now disconnected, it actually worked. Meaning I had three minutes to raid his base. Okay, how do you expect me to raid this? Is it just as simple as me walking in? There has to be a trap. Oh, okay. I almost jumped into that. Well, I'll first equip the gear. Can I just do this? Golden apples in the chest. There's... No that was a trap chest. And how did he get bedrock? Yo, I am sus, but I need to make my way inside. And with only one minute now remaining, I didn't have much time. Okay, this is either going to be very stupid or this might work. Wait. Yo, is that it? Wait, where's his loot? I need to show him back. This entire plan could fail. He's doing something really bad. Uh, he crashed my game. I have a bone to pick with that man. This is iron blocks. Oh my. All oh, these are filled with netherite. I don't have much time. Oh, he's still got the sniffer echo. 
Where did you say it was? We all gotta split up and we gotta go and find him. Empty out my entire inventory. And I'm gonna take all this for myself. Good enough. It's time to kind of leave. I am out of here. There are a lot of traps in your base right now, man. Oh, they're right there. I need to go the opposite way. They run faster than I thought. Oh, my. Whoa. I think I, I don't know what that was. I'm kind of glad I didn't step on those pressure plates. But I managed to barely escape them. And now I could upgrade my sniffer. I'll just pull that there. Put all this gear. If I use a lever. Wait, where's it gone? It's just speared. It, he's equipped it. He's overpowered. I didn't even know this was a thing. But they've realized I've stolen all the netherite. And since they were on high alert, they placed a player everywhere on the server. In the meantime, I'm going to equip myself with full netherite. And I'm kind of going to take you home. Because there's only 10 minutes left till the competition. And I need to survive. If he's not here, then... Then we just, uh, we blow it up. Smartest thing might be to keep you in my base. Yo, wait, 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 never mind. Maybe it's not the smartest thing. What are they, what are those guys doing there? Oh, 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 careful, careful. They're blowing it up. Wait, that means all my loot's gone. Look at these guys. Quit, if you don't come out, your entire house is gonna be blown up. I kind of need to grab their attention. Look up, he's on the dirt pillar. I think they know it's me, please. Is anyone there? Wait, he's dropping a drip zone. Wait, what? Oh! Yo, these guys are shooting, and you come with me. Yeah, get the sniffer on. Oh, get him too. Get him. Whoa, how did he die? Wait, 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 wait. No, no, no. Someone don't make sense. I'm running for my life. I'm running for my life. I'm running for my life. Even though I managed to kill someone, my sniffer died, meaning all my progress was lost. All I managed to get from that was eight hearts. And by redeeming, I only have nine. But it turns out when I was raiding Toby's base, they swapped out my sniffer, holding the real one captive. If you want your real sniffer, come to these cords. Well, I kind of do need it back, but they probably have made a trap. Kip, please, right there. Oh, wow. Look who decided to show up, huh? Where's my sniffer? Follow me. He's actually through there? I do. Take off your armor first, though. There you go. That's that's every arm in my inventory. All right. Welcome. See, I told you he was here. Okay, yeah. Uh, I'm going to take a sniffer and leave then, yeah? Okay, Ada! Yeah? Not so fast, buddy. Give Toby his armor back. I know you have it. I don't. I I, I seriously have no armor in my inventory. We're just going to blow you up if you say no, man. Okay, no, no, no. See? Was that so hard? Look at it. Look at all the armor. That's all yours, Toby. All right. Sniffer safe and sound. Get him. Oh, what? Was, what? my. Oh, hey there, buddy. Come here. Nope. 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 I'm getting closer. I'm going to cut him off. Now he's pearled again. Oh, my. Yo, yo, yo. Please tell me this works. Please tell me this works. Please, 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 please. Go, 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 oh, go, no. go, 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 and he's right here. Okay, we are leaving. They're currently trapped in the nether roof. And with no escape out, I was finally free. He couldn't have gone far. Where is he? How did they get out? Oh my. Okay, wait. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. Echo's close to him. Echo's get close. Up. Ah! Oh, oh, I got one of them. I've only got a little bit of time. Run. Go, Not go, again. go. Oh my. No, no, no. No, no. Oh, why is it? Careful, careful. Go out the way. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. What? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I barely survived with my sniffer. But now it was time for the real pet battle. You guys have already made it. Yeah, we've all got our pets, man. Well, I'm ready. Let's put our pets to the battle. Yeah, it's not just the pets, buddy. It's the owners, too. And uh, you're missing a chest plate. Wait, it's the owners? Yeah, that's right. Get him. Get Quiff. Get Quiff. Go, 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 go. Stop bow spamming. Oh, my God, you're so annoying. Oh, oh my. Oh. Yo, no. yo, yo, yo. My sniffer's going in. He's doing damage. You won't oh, no. oh, he's dead. No one's left. Other than the Elder Guardian. No one really cares about the Elder Guardian. All right, sniffer, you did amazing. My immortal sniffer won. They took revenge by banning my sniffer and stealing all the illegal hearts I got, which led me here. If you guys can land this MLG, you guys will gain a heart and quiff. You of all people need these hearts. So, I really uh, do. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Who wants to go first? Me. Me, 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 me. Oh, my. You guys. Oh, go, go, go. Dick, I okay. I don't have anything to, I don't have anything to MLG with. Not really my problem. There you go. And Wait, I pulled me! I've got it! 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 Oh my god! Wait, 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 what is this? What is this? Where am I? What? Oh my god! Oh, oh my wait, how am I in the end? I'm in the middle of nowhere! It turns out the MLG competition was fake. They abandoned me in the end. And now every minute I'll be losing one heart. It seems like this is completely void. Okay, it doesn't matter. What do I have in my inventory? Oh, none of this helps. If I start the platform out, will I find something? Okay, I see nothing. I'm completely stranded. And I've lost a heart. No! If I make a crafting table, I can think of multiple ways to escape. Oh my god, I can make another portal. But just as I start building. I remembered you can't use the nether portal in the end. And I've just wasted three obsidian. Okay, I can't be wasting resources right now. If I can make a platform, I can summon endermans. And then potentially get an ender pearl. And now I'm on one heart. This is bad. Come on, please spawn. I actually need so much to spawn right there. Or I'll lose my last heart and I'll be banned. The end is currently banned. So that's the entire reason I'm losing one heart every minute. Even if I was forcefully put here. Perfect. Exactly who I wanted. A pearl! Oh my god! 
Yes, now I can be risky. I can throw the pearl into the void and maybe land on a block. Or I'll fall all the way down and I've lost the pearl. Wait! Oh my god, I have an idea. I make blaze powder. I make an eye of ender. I can make it in a chest. Place it. And please. Oh, heart. A heart. Oh my god, I now have an extra heart. Okay, what else do I have? Um, Let me put all this in my inventory. And oh my god, I've lost my heart again. If I didn't find that heart, I was 10 seconds away from dying. And it would have been all over. Bro, I have a piston. Hey, build this. So how does this? None of this works. Oh my god, I've just got an insane idea. Since I'm currently in the middle of the end void, and I don't have enough blocks to bridge out, what if I somehow make a flying machine and escape using that? I have like 50 seconds before I die. Since I've already built out this way, this is going to be the safest option to build. So wasting no time, I built the flying machine. As soon as I break this, it's going to go off. I'm off. I'm flying away. Oh my God. I'm leaving the island behind. After traveling 100 blocks, I saw my escape. Okay, one second. Oh my God. I left my alt account in the trap. So if they came to check up on me, they'd see I'm right there. Using the remaining time I had, I had to come up with a plan to get infinite hearts. So I needed to collect resources, which involves mining this tree. I got five logs. I need more wood. So let's mine down this entire forest. And now I have a lot of wood. And it's good because I actually see no one around right now. So before I get spot, I'm going to quickly make two escape rooms. And using those escape rooms, I'm going to gain an infinite amount of hearts. This has to be the best plan. Now this looks like a normal box. How is this an escape room? I'm going to place buttons everywhere till this entire room is filled with buttons. And just like so, it's done. All I need to do now is block this off. The customer will pick a room and then he'll have four minutes to escape it. But little does he know while he's escaping the room, I'm inside his house stealing everything he has. So when he wins and wants the reward, it's all his loot. And instead, I'm going to be getting the hearts he has. And since I can't be caught, you're going to be the shopkeeper. I didn't really think about how I'm going to take this guy back. Okay, we're finally back. Let me, let me open this up. In you go. Okay, you're completely stuck now. I should put two hoppers down each side and use the signs to explain the room. No, I didn't tell you, Summer. If they pick the easy room, I'm going to steal their loot from their house and give the items back to get hearts. But if they pick the hard room, there's a chance that lava will spawn and it'll kill them. Let me take their hearts. All I need to do now is wait for our first customer. Oh my god, is that Barnik? So this is the escape room? Since Barnik's gone into the easy room, that gives me five minutes to find his house and steal everything from it. I don't have much time. Food, bro, I'll take the food. Oh my god, the jackpot. I've just got full OP netherite. I need to rename this because I don't have much time. Yo, this is a scam, bro. No, it has to be a scam. This is literally not working. I've renamed all the gear. And since there's two minutes left, can I find anything else in this house? Oh my god! Bro, what is it blew up? Oh my god. Wait, what? Did oh, Creeper! Creeper, you're insane! Since the creeper blew up, it uncovered a secret chest where he was storing his hearts. Okay, but two seconds left before he escapes. There's some on the roof. I had I didn't even see these. There we go, I threw it all. So when he comes out, you'll think the villager threw it. And now I just wait. He's right there. He's about to finish any second. Oh my gosh, wait, when did this open? Oh my god, wait. We got some armor and... Oh, we got both our hearts. Let's go! Oh my god, he doesn't know it's his own loot! With Barnick now telling everyone about the escape room, now's the time I really get hearts. Because someone's gonna instantly pick the hard room and they'll die. Meaning I'm up so many hearts. That's Nipsey! Wait, I gotta give three hearts? All right. Fine, you know what? Fine. He's giving the three hearts. This is good. <gasps> the door is open. Oh my god. This guy doesn't wait, know. Wait. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> no quiz! <laughs> Okay, I, I need to escape this place. And I've got these hearts. I have six hearts now. The problem was the escape rooms only worked once. So I had to come up with a new plan. And in search of my new plan, I uncovered something important. Welcome to this meeting, man. Hello, you are, you ready? There's a command block. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, sir. Okay, so as you can see, what we have here is uh, it's a command block. We're going to load up this command block with some commands. We're going to spawn them, and then the immortal player is going to kill them. Oh, okay. my God. It turns out they were cheating. They're using NPCs to exploit infinite hearts. So the immortal player has an infinite heart generator. So it's like a, a player, a new player every single time. Dude. Oh my god. Oh Just my god, that. this is bad. If they can do this, that means all the progress I'm gonna make is for nothing. Okay, I have an idea that involves my ult. So I have a bunch of TNT and before they come back, I'm gonna blow up their house. Because once the house blows up, it's gonna cause a distraction making them run away from the command block. Say goodbye to your house. And now I hide a little bit. They've been alert. Uh, we gotta go now. They gone perfect. Okay, I've gained two hearts, which is good. Since I'm not up, I can't activate the NPCs. So instead, I'm gonna try break this command block. I'm gonna try to break it the same way you break bedrock. And I've got one shot at this because they're probably on their way back right now. Put this here, please, 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 please. 
Please, I've broken it. They're on their way back right now, but I can kill two birds with one stone by quickly digging a pitfall. And voila, it's done. So now when they've rushed back to the command block, they'll activate the piston, making them fall to their death. I'll gain a heart while ruining their plans. What? The command block's got the command block. Where is it? You need to get, you need to get the immortal player right now to investigate this guy. Yeah. Oh my wait, god. Wait, wait, wait. No, no, they're not gonna fall for right, it. I'll see if I can find the command wait. block. Oh Where my god! It? Oh my god! I need to get out of here before he comes back. Since I've bought myself an extra hour, I'll move on to my next plan. After overhearing a conversation about Nesta wanting to gamble. I thought this was a perfect opportunity for me to gain fast hearts because he's one of the people that has the most hearts on the server And he sided with the immortal player. So if I can steal his hearts, I could become as strong as him So I invited him over. All right, let's see some gambling. Okay, yo, you're supposed to be in the hole I won't speak about it if you don't. Well, let, let, let's just, you know, ignore what just happened and uh, let's get straight to it okay, okay, how many hearts you have? I have 80 hearts on me right now. 80? Come on, come on, come on, give it to okay, me. Okay, what's it gonna be? Yes! Oh! I just lost 40 hearts! Yeah, I'm going all in. Oh, oh wait. I rolled? Oh. No! When Nesson now giving me his cheated hearts, I was slowly getting stacked, but I still needed more. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go now. Quick, okay, please, can... you have to help me. Oh my please, god. Please, please, it's okay. I don't have a lot of time. The immortal player, he wants my hearts, okay? I don't have that many. He wants over 100, okay? I need to win hearts fast. I learned what the immortal player was trying to do. He was collecting tax on people's hearts. And if this continued, he'd have over 1,000 hearts by the time I fight him. I had to rig this machine so I could take all her hearts for myself. Uh, yeah, I could do red. You've put your hearts in and off we go. I'm rooting oh, for you. Please. I don't like the immortal player. Oh, please, please, I need this. Oh my. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna leave. This is not working. No, no, stop, 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 stop. With Kipley about to leave, I had to persuade her to stay. All this plan would backfire and I'd be nowhere. Okay, I guarantee if you put it on black. Black, you'll win. All right, I'm trusting you. I'm trusting you on this. Okay, off we go. Off we go. Come on. Come on, please. This time. I'm rooting for you. It's oh, black. I told you. Right. It's black. You are so right. Oh my god. How many do you have? I have 89 hearts. I need 100, but I don't know, man. This is still too risky. I think I'm gonna go to the building competition instead. But thank you. This has been great help. The plan worked. Kipley trusted me enough to tell me what she was gonna do, and that involved going to a heart building competition. Now, if I go there, I can triple my hearts using a secret method, of course. All right, and there you go. I've given you my heart. Now that I've joined the building competition, I could go forward with my real plan, which was to make an infinite death trap machine. So when they check it out, they'll be trapped in an infinite death loop, and I'll be gaining all my hearts. The death trap's looking pretty good so far. Whenever they right click the bed, they've set the spawn, which will activate the trap. Lava will pour out and it'll infinitely kill them. And when they respawn, they're at the bed, doing it all over again. Lava will burn all this wood. Okay, there we go, it's fixed. I've only got one lava bucket though. While Kipley's building them up, I'm gonna go get more lava. Subscribe! Okay, I don't have much time. Take all this, it should be enough. Time to go back up. I need to sneakily wake my way back. Fill this all with lava, and it's done. One of you actually followed the prop. Just to give me the benefit of the doubt, I'll take a look at this one. Yeah, 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 check it out, check it out, check it out. It, it's a hologram. Like, if you go inside here, click on the bed, both of you guys. Ah, okay, I'm going, bro. Click on the bed. Whoa! Oh yeah, my god! No, yes! No, yes! No, Perfect, this is good, this is good, this is good. I took all their hearts, but before they were banned, they disconnected. Wait, they're right there. What are they planning? Guys, remember the plan, okay? If, if, if anything happens, you guys need to give me your hearts before you guys die, okay? That's the plan. <laughs> Wait, what? Forget it. It turns out Linux made a death loop. So when we fight, he's going to be cheating by taking all their hearts mid-fight. Now, I had to find out exactly where this was and do it myself. Oh my god, I found it. So when they die, I'll be getting hearts midway. And he'll be so surprised. Alright, so basically we go in into Linux death loop. So since he told us to do so. Oh my god, I barely escaped that. The five hours are up, Quiff. It's over. <laughs> You have to fight me. Come here. I am. I, I know over. I know why they call you it's... the immortal player. Yeah, I'm not scared of why? you. I, I overheard your conversation. With who? And I've replaced the lava oh. with mine. So I'm getting my hearts now. You're gonna die any second. One more hit. Wait. Oh, oh, oh my god. Oh my god. I just killed the most immortal player on the server. And my hearts are still going up. This is this is kind of broken. But once I had enough hearts, they needed me for the heart war. Quiff, we are at war. And if you don't want to be caught in the crossfire, pick a side. Listen, none of you guys actually chose me. You must land this MLG and pick your side at the bottom. But wait, what do I MLG with? With this. <laughs> whoa, whoa, no way. Pick up. Okay, I've got the scaffolding. Please tell me what in the world is this fight to survive? Oh, I survived the MLG and now I can pick a side. The red side has all the overpowered loot, which would make it the safest option. So I'm going to take all this and now I'm on the red team. Donate five hearts, but I only have five hearts. Take some steak instead. Because once I leave through this door, I'll be welcomed onto the red team. Hey guys, let's... 
Hello? I went through this door to only end up back in the middle. Uh, what is this? Am I missing something? Let me just remove some hearts and let me throw them in here. Can you at least open the door now? Yo, I've been scammed. Okay, can I take them back? It's disappeared from the hopper. Whenever I try to leave through the door, I only end up back at the middle. Okay, what do I have in my inventory? I have carrots and cobblestone. And I kind of guess it's scaffolding. But if I could have crafted a boat, I could have glitched through the walls. But even though I don't have a pickaxe, I'm just going to straight up mine out. Yeah, you tried to outsmart me. But you guys are actual idiots. Oh my. Nope, I was the idiot. What is this? Please. If he's still down there, he's dead, man. Whoa, 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 whoa. I have an idea. I have an idea. All right. Oh, yo, she's right there. If I'm spotted right now, since I'm on one heart, she can instantly kill me. Boys, bring me up. We gotta activate the lava. Wait, what lava? Yo, wait. What is going on? They never wanted me on either team. Instead, they wanted to trap me. So I'd slowly die. I see the lava right there, which means it's coming down. And where did you come from? But look like a fish with this water. Well, I got a saddle. This might work. Because I could put the saddle on the pig and try find an escape that way. I make this a carrot on a stick. And we kind of go. But look up there. The lava's coming. Just to make sure it's actually lava. If I throw this there. Yeah, my blocks are kind of burning. But also, why? I do have half a shadow. Either way, if I ride you out of here, get in here and shift. Let me escape. That's not working. They've made sure to block any escape, meaning there was a 0% chance I'd survive this. I heard water down here, so maybe I can actually escape. But what is this? I swear this lava just got a little bit more down. What if I break out this way? What is that? Yeah, that's all lava, so I won't survive. But what if I jump? Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh my, what happened? Well, this is bad. It seems like while the lava's falling, the void is rising. But good thing you survived. And we're gonna head this way. Just believe in the process. We're through, we're through, we're through, we're through, we're through. We're currently in the middle. And if you can see at the top, there's water. If I was to shift, no, brother, he doesn't want to go there. Come back here. Yo, the lava's getting very close. This is where you clutch up. I go in here. Oh. Oh my, I think, where's the pig gone? Well, the pig kind of died into the water. That was beyond close. The wall was an illusion. It was never happening. They just wanted me off the server. But now that I'm out, why not get my revenge? By creating the biggest war in Minecraft. And the lines right there. These lines cover the entire world. And I'm currently on the blue side. And if I now jump over, yeah, I'm in the middle. And yes, this is my area. Since I'm on neither team, I've been given a small piece of the middle. And if I'm caught on either line, I'll instantly be killed. But what happened to my house? Why is it completely gone? It seems like while I was choosing a side, someone ransacked my house, destroying everything in the process. Skidzy, what is this? Yo, Mr. Quiff, this is uh, this is called opportunity. It's whoa, my chest plate. Put it back. Put it back, bro. It's my chest plate. Yo, nope. There's hey, no yo, hey, yo, I'm this. pulling out the bow. Oh, I'm pulling okay, out the bow. Okay, relax, Come relax, here. relax, relax. There you Come go. here. Bro, there you go. Give it back. There, there you All go. Right. Now let's be civilized, okay? You could still win this chest plate. You legitimately blew my house and took it. There's a water bucket right here. Uh, And what if I don't want to? Listen, Quiff, you're on our side of the territory. You cross the line. You could either MLG or I'll kill you. Yo, this is a trap. This. Oh, I'm out here. Oh, yo. That was, that was a little too close. But where's he gone? People didn't care about my life. They wanted to kill me for their own entertainment. And when I reached the surface, no one was there. Okay, I don't know where they went, but they've left the chest plate. This is a leather tunic, meaning he must have swapped it out before he left. Now I can just keep this, which means I've already lost, or I can use this in my favor to start a giant war. But first I'm gonna go to the blue team and create a quick shop. For now, I'm gonna place this here. But this is part one of my revenge. Netherite is currently banned on the server but there'll be players trying to abuse it which is why i'm gonna sell this but they'll realize it's fake netherite pretty quick so instead i first need to dig out this area and oh my well honestly this kind of works in my favor although i almost died but now that the trap's been dug out time to add a bunch of signs and replace the floor with moss carpet so it completely looks like grass yeah this looks pretty good for the war to start i first need a big distraction which means killing someone and he's right there I'm supposed to be on this oh, server, wait like, on my oh my yo relax you're not supposed to be alone yo 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 no kill me yo yo no 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 bro relax you do realize netherite is banned yeah but listen do you want it yeah I'll t you know i'll take it yeah bro nice there you go there you go look at that wait hold on a second this isn't a netherite yeah oh let's go but i'm now part of the blue team but since sourceless died people are gonna go investigate his death which was the distraction i needed oh my gosh is this where sourceless died the blue team has a special pet who's actually their mascot and and if that pet was stolen, it'd cause so much chaos. Of course, the blue team rolls up. 
Look who oh. it is, huh? Oh, he's right there. Where are you running? Well, either way, you're kind of coming with me. Okay. Sorcerer's dying here. What have you guys done to him? But Sorcerer's death won't distract them forever. And if they see me with the cat, they'll destroy my last life. Hey, yo, we did not kill Sorcerer's. We were investigating the crime scene. Okay, so back up. Don't mind me. We're heading this way. And I'm honestly going to lock you right here. This is your new home, aka your hostage. I'm the lost one from the red side over, with the prize being the cat. Because once they win and take it back home, which will be the start of the war. But I'm gonna message Skizzy to come to my area and he's just said on my way now This building's in between both the lines. So when he sees it, he's gonna go and investigate. Yo, mr Quiff, what's going on? Yo, okay. Welcome to my little mini game mini game Ooh, what, What's this all about and the prize there is the cat. Hey, no way dude. I'm in okay Yeah, it's completely free. All right, listen listen. Let me get you right because of the whole chest plate thing I got a heart right here. Let me at least give you a heart. Oh wait, okay. Yeah, all right sick with now also acquiring Skidzy's heart, this was off to an amazing start. Click the dispenser. All right. Ooh, red for red. Nice. And once I click hey. this button, you need to match the color with the actual thing. So please give me red. I can feel it in my bones. It's going to be red. Let's yes! go! Yeah, Woo! you won! Come here, Mr. Bloxy. You got a new dad. Yeah, door's right there. Yeah, all right. Let's get out of here. Let's go get some ice cream or something. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll see you soon. Very soon. With Skizzy now taking the cat back home, it was the perfect time to frame him. And I had to travel all the way over to the blue side. And now that I'm back here, well, I'm literally going to put here, yoink mine now. But right now, they have no idea who stole the cat. But Skizzy gave me his heart. And legitimately says Skizzy's heart. Bro, you made this too easy. Toby, where? Where's Bloxy? Oh my. Why is Kipley so mad at me? Skidzy? Where's our cat, man? I need to have a word with you. I never stole any cat. Kipley found the evidence and she was out for blood. You got a bounty on your head, buddy. Well, I kind of expected this. But with Skidzy being a high profile target, he had nowhere to run. Meaning they're going to find him and kill him, which will be the start of the war. Hey, yo. Hey, yo, you framed me. What do you mean? Okay, this is the ugliest house I've ever seen, but that, that's irrelevant, dude. You framed me with the cat. I did not. What, what cat, bro? I have no idea what you're about. Loxy, bro. You gave me the cat, bro. Yo, okay. Yo, listen, listen. I have an idea. I have a very good idea that's going to save you. What? I'm literally going to kill you right now, bro. You gave me a contraband cat. Stand there for a second. This is actually going to help you win. I had to keep Skizzy distracted. Otherwise, he'd kill me. Okay, you see this dispenser in here? All right, what, what, what is this, dude? What? You, what are you doing, Quiff? Okay, yo, listen, listen, you see this? Yeah, okay, there's a button. Toby, Quiff just messaged us. Come to my house. What? Skidzy is here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so in this button, this is how, you ch this is how it's gonna save you. If you get the diamond right now, you're gonna you're gonna survive. Dude, what What do you what do you mean save no, me, trust bro? Trust me, trust me, click it, bro, click it. It's actually gonna help you. Dude, I don't even want this diamond, bro. It's not gonna help me at all. Hey, Skidzy, what's up, man? What's up, Skidzy? Oh, hey, yeah. my. They actually killed me. I appreciate what you did, but uh, why are you wearing blue, buddy? There you go. I was saving it for you guys. Oh, oh why has it got a barrier, huh? Listen, you can have everything else. Uh, I'm going to be confiscating this. But the plan worked. Kipley killed Skidzy, meaning blood was drawn. But the red team wasn't going to sit back and do anything, meaning the truce had been broken, and this was the start of the war. I don't know why Skidzy had a barrier. I'm not going to question it, because since the war's starting, people need a lot of armor, which is why I'm going to just make this. And now I have another right chest plate, which is um, kind of cool. Kipley, are you, are you around here? Uh, Is that you? No. Well, I know you're the one behind all of this. So, so I didn't. I didn't saw no war. I didn't saw any war. Wait, no. He disconnected, bro. Oh my, he actually disconnected. With sources realizing it was all me, the entire plan crumbled. Because if he manages to tell everyone else, they will realize it's all me, and the war will never start. Well, for now, I'm gonna place this here, just so if it respawns, he'll suffocate, which will at least buy me some time, right? But before he joins back, the war needs to already be over. So let's make things worse by replacing the entire world with barriers because right now you have the red line and the blue line and my area in the middle but what if there was nothing just barrier meaning no one could escape that area well don't mind me but i'm on the red side now and hopefully i don't get spot through some window but i'm looking for barriers and seriously does no one have any that must mean skitty used an illegal glitch to get barriers and kipley has the only one on the server and if i want barriers i first need to find her and that's why i'm here because i'm looking for an informant galactic Galactic, Galactic, I'm here, I'm here. Yo, yo, Cliff, watch out. Whoa, 
What is that? If you try anything, sus, I'm gonna blow us both up. I need to know where Kipley is, and I will give you a netherite chest plate. She's building something under her base right now, but you didn't hear it from me. Uh, yeah, I'm kind of infiltrating blue side. But that's her house right there, meaning she should be somewhere around here. But I'm currently on one heart, meaning I can kind of get one shot. And if Kipley sees me, she'll instantly try to kill me. Well, this is a bit of a new plan. Since the server was updated to 1.20, there's a lot of new bugs I can exploit. Like, for example, I can eat this and have permanent health, but what I need is in there. A regen 2 potion. But before I finish drinking this potion, I need to eat a notch apple, which will bug the game into giving me permanent regen. Time, 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 time. Oh, see! I didn't even finish drinking it, but it disappeared. Oh, please tell me this works. Right now, I have regen 2, and it's going down. But as soon as it hits 0, it, it's going back up. Well, I have permanent regen, which is kind of broken. But now that I've become immortal, I can instantly kill Kipley, taking the barrier and replacing the entire world with it. And I'm getting closer to Kipley's house. The door seems to be open, so I kind of have no idea who's around here. And knowing Kipley, she'll have a whole army around her. And that's kind of why I built this. I'm going to distract the players on this server with a build battle. And that's what I'm going to tell them in the chat. Problem is, I kind of have one heart. And that's why I brought on my ult. Uh, this might be slightly illegal, but, well, I'm gaining hearts like crazy. And, yeah, this might definitely be the smartest way to get hearts. But I've now lost five hearts, which I've put inside here. Because revenge is simple. Since they'll need hearts for the war, everyone will try to play this game. Which will be the perfect time to strike Kipley. Mr. Quiff, what, uh, what's going on here? Okay, yo, listen. I know there's a war, but this is kind of a true spirit. I know every single person needs hearts. And inside this chest, there's five hearts. Okay, I like what I'm seeing. The person who can build the best dragon can take him. Hey, yo, what? All right. Yeah, you have 15 minutes. Good luck, guys. No cheating. And now that they were distracted, oh, she's actually right there. I have no idea what she's building, but I'm gonna kill her. I think she's AFK. Hold on, let me kind of get a little bit closer. Put the god apples in my inventory like this. And as soon as I jump down, it's over. Wait. Wait. Get down there, buddy! Wait, get down there! Wait! No, 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 no! Okay, wait, this is bad. This is bad. This is very bad. This is very bad. Yeah! Okay, I'm infinitely falling into the void right now. Even look at my Y. Look how deep I'm going. But since I was immortal, I was infinitely falling. And there was no escape. Okay, I'm running out of god apples right now. This is gonna be very, very interesting. Like, look at this. I don't even need to eat the god apples. These guys are playing me. What can I even do? But just in case anything went wrong, I set up an ender stasis chamber that would activate once it turned night. No way. That was pretty good thinking. I think those guys are still building. Hey, yo, I definitely have the best dragon so far. But Kipley was one step ahead of me, meaning someone told her about my presence. But I'm gonna rush back and she won't even realize. A stroke of genius! Oh my! Oh yeah, you're not escaping oh. now? You are not How escaping! Did How did you get out, man? Ah! Ah! Yeah, you are not ah! gonna, you, you're gonna do what? no damage to me. You're actually Why gonna are die. You damage? What? Quick, don't do this! Don't do this! Don't do this, please! No! No! Oh! And there's the barrier! Yes! Okay, and we've got it right here. And also a heart. Oh, this is Skidzy's heart. They never redeemed it. Idiots, I'm taking that for myself. But now I got the barrier, which means I could finally replace the world with them. Okay, guys. Yeah, all right. Let's 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 check these builds out. Uh, it's Tucker. Kind of trash. Yeah. What? Flux, yours looks pretty good. I can't lie, but yeah, these are all yours. Take them. You guys can leave my area now. No, Tucker. You tried your hardest. That's all that matters. But there's a slight problem. If I place this barrier down, I'll have no more left. Well, let's hope this works. I'll place the shulker here. One barrier. I hope this works or this is going to just completely fail. So if I click this right now, one barrier, two barriers. I've just got two barriers. I'm not saying exploit, but 1.20 is kind of sick. Two barriers. We have four barriers. This is broken. And after exploiting this bug, I had an infinite amount of barriers. This is so many. When did my resistance disappear? I think abusing two glitches kind of broke it. Well, that's kind of weird, but hey. I'm not complaining, but I'm gonna take these and just to see if they work. Yo, yeah, I can't walk past these. This is busted. I'm still curious how we got this, but I don't know if these barriers are ghost blocks. Only visible to me, but there's a very simple test. Okay, I've covered all this in barriers, which either this is gonna work or it's gonna fail. I wish I could see those though, but I'm now gonna kill a player. And once I break his bed, he should spawn in the barriers. And my target's in there. If I splash invis on myself, oh, please. Okay, that almost messed up. Man, my house looks beautiful, guys. I I've been working on this house for so long. Yeah, he's doing smart. I don't know what he's doing. And it's almost complete. I'm so excited to show Quiff too. Bye to your bed, brother. Oh, oh my. Okay, I don't have time. What the? Wait, what? Oh, what just happened? Okay, well, that's good. He didn't spawn there. Okay, yeah, this kind of works. Uh, Wait, I can't move. Okay, what? yeah, this kind of works. Wait, uh, wait. 
Quiff, is that you? Yeah, okay, so the barriers actually work. Oh, my miss ran out. Perfect timing. Well, that's good to know. Poor Rage. He just rejoined. Now that I know that this works, this might take a very long time, but it's 100% going to be worth it. Because now I'm going to replace the entire world with barriers. I think this might be enough. Yeah, this is sick. And since I brought both teams onto one side, one team physically can't go back, which will create the wall. When did they come here? Yo, what is going on there? Okay, I really have no idea what's going on, and I'm kind of scared. Tell them now. They built a wall. Get up. I just hope I don't mess this up, because if I do, it might be a little bit GG. So many barriers. Yeah, these guys don't understand. Their world is about to be over. Their spawn is now barriers. Meaning when they die, they'll live in a world that's only blocks. No, no, no. Get away from him. Yo, everyone's dying. Hey, yo, hey, I need help. I need help. This is crazy. Oh, it's ah. like a 20v1. Ow. What am I missing? This is perfect. This is perfect. I do want to do this. Actually, I really want to do this. Come here. Whoa. Oh. Oh my perfect freaking idiots man why am I in here with you the likes of you Okay this is sick Oh what am I doing in here bro which one yeah. are you getting wrong? Uh, I'm just gonna let you guys know it was actually me and thank you no. Kipley and Skidzy Here here let me out I can I can give you stuff I can give you things Take these uh, we yeah. can negotiate See you guys right. later What if you could make one heart the same as one million using only one simple glitch? Well it first started when I joined the server In three hours from now there will be a massive fight on the server and the player with the lowest hearts will die and be banned. The rules are no scamming or killing. I'll see oh, you guys go, later. Go, 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 let's go, go. Let's go. Everyone rushed outside the building, finding the best way to survive the competition. And with only two hearts, I came across this. Quick, come over here. Come okay, over here. I'm here. I'm here. No. What are you selling? All the stuff right here for just a heart. Hot, oh, I'm redeeming that right now. Okay, I've redeemed it. Here, take that. Boom. You have to sumo the person at the top and win. I have to be the person at the top and win? Indeed. After climbing up the scaffold, I was one punch away from being overpowered. Fight. Okay. No, it's over. It's over. You're off. You're off. You're off. Oh, whoa. Whoa. Oh, what just happened? The sumo competition was a scam and they were out to kill me. They stole my last heart and I got nothing in return. Where are you guys? Wait, it's gone. And the scaffold on the floor? Meaning they destroyed the arena and ran away, leaving no evidence behind. But Loki, you guys kind of forgot about this. So this is kind of mine now. And I'm partially stacked. That means for one heart, I got three items. I'm going to kind of make use of this. I'm going to turn this into red all the way. And now this is my shop. If I can sell these three items for three hearts, I'll have made a profit. And after waiting two minutes, someone finally arrived. Hey, Quiff. What you, what you selling today? Okay, I have these three items here. How about this? I give you one heart for that netherite sword on the left. Deal. Okay, that's easy deal. There you go. There you go. Oh my. Okay, yeah, thank you. With the netherite sword now sold, I officially gained my heart back. But I still had two more items. Like, seriously, why is no one else coming? The sun's gone down. After waiting for an eternity, Nimsy came back. Hey, Quiff, I'm back. How did you gain so much health in a short amount of time? I mean, I have my ways. So what do you want to buy? I need the, those netherite boots over there. I think those would be nice. Okay, one heart. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, sick. Okay, perfect. All right, later. Oh, my. All right, perfect. And after waiting another full day, no one else arrived at my shop. I got two hearts. So let me do the chest plate and let me just burn this place. Because it doesn't seem to be working. I'm now an arsonist. But my hearts were low compared to other players. So I had to figure out how they were gaining hearts. Yo, what am I hearing? This netherite sword for guess how many hearts? Seven. So, oh, Just seven. What was that? The items he was buying for me, he was selling at his own shop for triple the price. They're actually buying off him. That explains it. The reason no one came to my shop is because he had all the customers. I really want to kill Nimsy, but he's with everyone right now. Well, good thing I have these hearts. I've recently learned of a bug that's only possible if you withdraw one heart. And that's why you're here, my beautiful alt account. I'm going to give you one heart and redeem the other one. For this glitch to work, I need to kill my alt. All I do is put TNT here. Here, make sure it's enough to kill me and I'll watch from here and now I'm on my alt account and I'm standing on the TNT since I have four hearts I only have three tries I need this command ready as soon as I light the TNT I'm gonna run the command and freeze my game causing a glitched heart bang frozen but you can hear the TNT I see the heart right there and I've got it but there's only one way to test this I remove my heart and it's there and I can't stack them let's go now this heart is broken all the damage that killed my alt account is inside this heart meaning when redeemed it will blow the player up and Nimsy's still there.
there. I'm coming for you. I need a way to give Nimsy the heart without being caught. Toby, Toby, Toby. Hello. Do you still have your collection of heads? Yeah. Can I get Barnix? How much are you paying for that? Uh, this one heart right here. I like that. Here you go. Okay, perfect. Uh, good do business with you. Now that I've secured someone's head, it was time to go fully undercover. Nimsy's here. Nimsy's Yo, here. Bionic, what's up? Oh. You want um, something from my shop? You want a chest plate? Here, uh, let me let me get one real quick. That'll be one heart. Redeem Thank that. Thank you. Redeem that. All right, I'm just going to redeem this heart now. Love you, Bionic. Nimsy was blown up. That actually worked. And my invis kind of run out. But I've got 19 hearts. Oh, I'm rich. I'm so rich. Now I have some hearts. I built my next plan. And I was going to make a profit of 100 hearts. And welcome to chest roulette. But I'm going to put two hearts in each shulker. And in the yellow ones, put dirt. With this, I'm able to turn one heart into 10. Quiff, I followed the hole and ended up here. Uh, do you have heart on you? I do. Now, welcome to chest roulette. Right. You see this gold block over here? Yes. Your aim is to get it closer to the red shulkers as much as possible. And if you land on the red shulker, you get what's inside. But if you get it to the yellow, you just get dirt. And you have 18 hearts now. Perfect. Your aim is to get oh it as my. close to the red as possible. Oh! Oh. Yeah, you get to take what's inside here. And your hearts are going up. Perfect. And we're off again. Okay, can you be two for two? Oh. You're close to the yellow. With Emo a little suspicious, I couldn't make this scam too obvious. So I made him win all the hearts. Oh, you won! Yes. Congrats, you've won every heart in the machine. And your hearts are climbing a lot right now. Okay, Quiff, I'm gonna go now. All right, yeah. Yeah, tell people how good this machine is. Will do. See you later. With Emo now spreading a rumor of the best way to gain hearts, everyone lined up to my machine. And this is where the real plan started. Hey, Quip, Emo told me about this thing you have for hearts. Yeah, yeah, no, this is exactly what I mean. How many hearts do you have in your inventory? I have 24 hearts. Yo, pff, oh, you're going all 24? Perfect. And it's going off. And you kind of got dirt. You're pretty unlucky. With the first player now scammed, I had 30 hearts. And I was making so much progress. The competition was mine to win. Let me claim all these hearts we have 10 12 14 we now have 45 hearts together which yo did i drop them where did they go everyone that entered the casino scammed me they gave me fake hearts which disappear after three minutes meaning i was back to one where did my heart quit uh, you stole all my hearts but no uh, what do you mean ah, i i realized it was you who killed me. Nimsy found out and now he's after my life. The problem is I only have one heart so he could punch me and i die. This won't make up for it. Good good meeting you yeah uh I'm just gonna do this. Well, well, where do you think you're going? And I'm gonna eat this. What? Since this machine is a scam, I had a button that would erase all evidence by blowing the entire place up. Oh, perfect. I heard it all blown up. Nimsy was blown up. With all the evidence erased, Nimsy died in the crossfire. And since he was caught scamming, he was banned, meaning my plan worked. But I'm still on one heart. And there's only two people that currently have my hearts. And if I want to get revenge, I have to be sneaky. And Kipley, that's why I need you. What? For what? Since there's a lot of eyes on me, I can't break the rules. But I can hire someone to. I see you don't have much hearts. Yeah, it's a bit rough. I have more than you, though. Well, let's team up. I can make it so we have an infinite amount of hearts. Wait, what? How? I just need you to create a shop and sell certain hearts. I can do that. Kind of goodbye to you again. Take that. And let me watch from a distance. Blow. Paste. Pause. I think it's going off. Oh. The heart. I've got it. All right, Kipley. Yeah? All right, take this heart. Just don't redeem it. That's the heart you need to sell. I'm telling you right now. You redeem uh... it, you're dead. With Kipley now creating a shop and putting the deadly heart into circulation, the two players were now split. And I could kill the other player. My target is inside there. And I don't know exactly what she's doing. But I'm still on one heart. A fight against her would lead to my death. That's where you kind of come in? Run. Run for my life. Are you following? I can't tell if he's following. He's there. After leading the warden back to the house, I splashed it with invis, making him the perfect assassin. The warden's killing her. Wait, is it down there? What? How did they even get there? How, how, how many hearts does she have? Oh, she died. Perfect. Warden, you've done a great job. Where did she die? Where did she die? Oh, perfect. I just got 22 hearts. And I'm going to quickly leave. I was never here. With my kill successful, it was all down to Kipley. I'll give you this heart, Ben. Okay, it is a very special heart. Good luck. You're gonna need it. Kipley, Kipley, Kipley. What? Has Emo taken the hearts? Yes. That's all I needed to know. Perfect. Any second Emo was about to die. And I had to take all my hearts back. It just died! Emo was blown up! I mean the heart worked and I've got 57 hearts! But using this, I'm gonna become immortal. But now with Emo dead, Kipley thinks I framed her. And she's after revenge. Because in 20 minutes, if she can't clear her name, she'll be banned. Quip, where are you? You're oh! Camera. I know you're in here! She's guarding my house? I have 57 hearts. But Kipley now has over 200. And I'll die if I try fight her. But who said anything about me fighting her? Skizzy. Quiff. Uh, I see you've got over 300 hearts. Yes, sir. I'm gonna give you 57 right now. Ooh, okay. I right, need you right. to go and kill Kipley. Because she's after my life. Okay, I'll do it. With you and your army? Bro, I'll bring my army. 
We'll right. have her dead, bro. That's exactly what I like to hear. With Skizzy now on my side, I had a righteous reason to kill Kipley, and he was on board. Oh my god, his army's getting ready. And they look stacked. Kipley stands no chance. Now you might be thinking, Quiff, you're back on one heart. Why did you give the hearts to him? I'm not stupid. I could easily kill Kipley, but I needed Skizzy on my side. That's because under his house, he has a vault full of hearts, and I need to enter. And I'm just gonna walk straight in because he's not here. I don't know exactly what's going on. So if I was to just uh, shoot that, oh, and that opened. So let's quickly make my way there. Oh yes, this was the jackpot. Skizzy has the most protected base and I had to lure him away from his house just so I could sneak in. And I'm gonna take all these hearts, but I can't really fit them in my inventory. But I have an idea. Am I able to use the pause gauge to absorb 1 million hearts? Well, time to test it. Okay, I've just redeemed a heart. I don't know what's going on, but I hear a bunch of sound. I can see my heart going down here. My heart's gone down one, but I'm still stuck on one. I have 15 hearts, but it only shows one, which means I think it works. And after abusing the glitch, I became immortal. This is either gonna fail or it's gonna work. Wait, I'm taking no damage. I'm actually taking no damage. Okay, uh, just in case, I don't know how many hearts I've actually redeemed. But yo, this is kind of crazy. And I've got nothing, no resistance, nothing. Inside my one heart, there's a million. And I kind of need to leave now because Kipley died, which means they're heading back here. Quiff, I'm tracking you. We're gonna kill you. Wait, how is he tracking me? My heart. It turns out Skidzy put trackers inside his heart. And now since I've redeemed them, he can constantly track me. And it's turning night again, which means I only have to survive for 20 minutes and the competition's over. And that's why I'm outside this nether pole. Because on the opposite side of this is the nether roof. I'm gonna lure his army inside and trap them here. I should wear some gear though. Either way, I have the TNT and the flint and steel. And after waiting two minutes, they arrive. Skidzy sends us after you, Quiff. We're gonna get you whether you like it or not. Well, you catch me first. That's all I'm gonna say. You guys are kind of far. Yeah, yeah. No. No, what? no, 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 no. no, no. Don't no. go in there. Don't. Yeah, you guys are not gonna catch me. Get back here, Quiff. Run. He's literally one shot. I hope you're, you're all trapped. Wait, no. <laughs> Yo, you guys are actual idiots. And I'm out. But Skidzy's still left. But with his army in the nether roof, he couldn't fight me alone. And I had to just wait for the competition to end. The competition is now over me at the arena? Well, just to show off a power that I am, I'm just gonna go in with this and a stone axe. The competition has now ended. You guys will fight it out. The player with no hearts will be banned. Rough. Die! No. Oh it's my god. Everyone focus quick. Yeah, everyone focus quick. Oh, focus why are you focusing me? He's a scammer. I'm on one heart Wait, and he's still gonna kill me. No, 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 You're no, one, no. you're one. Yes. No. I did. Oh. Tell me, no. no. get dead. away from me. Tell me, you're dead. Oh. Why are you not oh. No, no. This is insane. It is so, no. so, so. Stop. Stop. <laughs> Oh, what? My heart's not even regening. I don't even know why, but this is overpowered. We killed everyone, and I was the survivor. This is a camel, one of the weakest mobs to ever exist. But using one simple glitch, I'm able to turn him into the most dangerous mob who's completely immortal. Because it first started when I joined the server. Yo, guys, what's going on? Quiff, you're late to the pet competition. It doesn't stop for another minute. Which means you have last pick of all the pets. How is this actually fair? This is what the girls decided. I don't need to deal with this. Nah, 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 nah. You gotta deal with it, buddy. Oh, my. Yo, what's this? I don't have anything to clutch with. I see a person. What's this? Oh, my. Oh, I just clutched last minute. Man, what is this room? They've patched up the ceiling. But first of all, what is this? I currently see three pets left. Luckily, the warden's still left, but he costs 30 hearts. And I currently have six. So I can't really get him. But what about the goat? Who costs 15? They wanted me to have the weakest mob by increasing the price of each pet. I guess the only thing I could buy is the camel. Although I kind of need to make my way towards you. Okay, you're not that bad, right? It must be to do with the sapling. So if I just aim this straight up above, it should be facing the camel now. So if I just withdraw five hearts like this, if I put them in, yeah, they've disappeared. You have chosen the camel. The camel is currently hidden and you must find it. And it's completely disappeared. But there was a bigger problem than my camel disappearing. Wait a second, what is this? And then the sand's slowly being raised. Are these guys trying to suffocate me? I think I'll need this sapling and I'll take this free dirt. Now, if I was just to mine out, I could escape the falling sand. But wait, it leads to a different room? At least one to a second portion of this and... Oh, we've ended up back here. If I was throw some coal in there, the coal ends up right here. Which means all the walls are connected to the middle. In the meantime, well, I have the chance. What if I just try create a tree? Is this able to go faster? At least I can now make wood. I now should have enough blocks to actually build up because my entrance might be my only exit. So we keep going. All right, simple. I've just gone through. What is that? So that means all the exits are blocked off. And I don't know if I'm tripping, but I think the sand got a lot faster. Wait, why, why can I not move? I can't jump either. And I think I'm slowly sinking, meaning this sand is slowly turning into quicksand. So there's a high chance I'll suffocate and die. I have an idea though. Because look how fast I'm sinking. If I just quickly make a furnace and smelt my iron, I could break the blocks around it 
it. But I don't think I could break this block. It's to my chest. But I have enough iron now to make a minecart. I'm so small. I will be using this though. I think I'll be taking this crafting table too because I think I need it. Well, we have six iron left. And I think the smallest thing might be to get some high ground. Because look how crazy this looks. Now, this might be very stupid, but I need to get to that. We made it at least. And... Yeah, I don't know if I've messed it up, but it's definitely going a lot faster now. Oh, wait, I think I'm in quicksand. This was not the block to go on. I've lost the minecart. Oh, no. I could take all this to now make a boat. The sand's now turned into lava. I don't know who I made mad. Now, look at that. There's lava pouring from the ceiling. If I was put a tree here and wait for it to grow like this, I now have more blocks. All this for a camel? I don't know if it's even worth it. While I'm trapped in this prison, the girls are securing my camel. Hiding in the perfect location. But what if I was to block this off? This might be very risky because I'm on one heart. Either I'll take suffocation down damage and die or i'll escape place that there oh oh my was it right beneath here okay i don't even know what that is but now that i've escaped i've wasted a lot of time so my camel could be anywhere well i've come across this and i think my camel's inside this giant pyramid because why else would there be two netherite gods there all right toby we have one job he's our job today now if i try to walk inside and try to steal my camel they'll instantly kill me but it's a good thing i'm surrounded by trees because if i just make a flint and steel and create a little bit of forest fire uh toby it'll burn all the trees creating the perfect extraction for me to walk in Okay, I think this is going good. Uh, Toby, the whole forest is on fire, man. I think they may have spotted it, but I just need them to leave. I was already leaving. Yeah, go, go put the fire out. Bring a water bucket or something, man. But I think Kipley's still guarding, but I do have an ender pearl. But I'm on one heart. Meaning if I was to try an ender pearl to get close, I'd die from fall damage. But I have no idea what that is or if it can even help me. But the best way of me obtaining my camel is to first get stacked. Yo, what's this? Oh, Quiff, I didn't expect you here. Wait, win netherite chest plate? You come over over here and if you win this you get that chest plate so i have to just land this mlg wait, yeah but what does it cost it's free wait seriously since i've fallen for droppers before i investigated this entire build and it turned out to actually be real so all i do is mlg right yeah yo wait i have an ender pearl just in case and wait why is this going on forever <laughs> Wait, this makes no sense. Okay, before I start to panic, I used to trust my gut and MLG like that. But this seems to be an infinite dropper. But that should be impossible. But I didn't know the girls had a lever that would change this entire dropper to make it a prison for me. I need a way out of here. So what happens if I drop to the second ledge over here? It's very risky since I'm on one heart, but them trapping me only means one thing. Kipley! Quiff is in the infinite dropper. Oh, beautiful. All right. Well, it's a good thing we had scouts everywhere. Grab the camel. We're moving him. I've been in enough infinite droppers to realize that this boat should infinite infinitely fall. Okay, will this actually drop infinitely? I think it's dropping infinitely. If I drop to the second layer now, the boat's completely gone, meaning any item you can sit in will glitch you out this dropper. So now if I make a minecart, it should theoretically have the same impact. Yeah, this should work. I don't have much time. I don't know where they're taking my camel, but it just seems like I'm infinitely falling. I just keep falling, keep getting momentum over here. Oh, wait, that's my boat. Oh, okay, yo, let me drop all the way down. Yo, it was that simple. After escaping, no one was to be seen. And my camel was relocated. All right, Toby, help me get this camel in the middle. But they've left this netherite chest plate, which is on breaking free and prop four. And to me, this is kind of useless. But since netherite is pretty rare, I'll be able to sell it for a good item, which will help me in my war against the girls. Now, there's a girl's house right there. So if I make a quick shop in front of it... What are you doing outside my house, dude? Yo, yo, chill. I've got this netherite chest plate. Take it or leave it. I'm going to kill you if you don't take that. A brush thank you thank you maybe making a shop there was my mistake because for a netherite chest plate i ended up getting only a brush and i think if i brush a grass block right now it's not even gonna give me anything so this item right now is useless but using the brush you're able to get one exclusive mob which is actually the sniffer and since we're playing in the latest 1.20 update there's a few bugs that comes along with the mob for example this is a normal sniffer and this is a normal camel completely vanilla mobs and in normal survival these guys don't hit back at all but mojang released a new patch on july the 18th where it said it's fixed the sniffer and camel attacking when holding rabbit's foot. But currently, I'm not on that patch. So if I get a rabbit's foot and now go in survival mode, these guys will actually try to fight me in survival mode. Like, look at this. Yo, why is a camel and sniffer both trying to kill me? And that's why I'm out in the ocean looking for that right there. That's because suspicious sand is the only way to get a sniffer. Instead, we got some trash loot. This one right here, which Loki, what is it? Okay, that was horrible. And we got a sniffer. Yo, I got what I needed. Now, hatching the sniffer is the only way I'll be able to get my camel back. And what better place to hatch it than in front of the dragon egg? Because no one really comes here. Now, I just need to find the location of my camel, which is why I'll be missing Fermi. He's the only other person I could trust right now. Oh, Quiff just sent me a message. Wait. What? What did it say? He wants me to help him find his camel. <laughs> oh, this camel, huh? What should I do? Do not tell him where it is, okay? 
He thinks you're on his side, all right? We got to lead him on some wild goose chase. Yeah, I can do that for sure. Now, in the meantime, I need a lot of rabbit's foot and I've only literally got one. But Thermite just said, sure thing. Well, this stuff is not hatched yet, but Thermite just said it's in a cherry blossom biome last I heard. And there's only one I know of, which is over 1,000 blocks away. And I've finally arrived, meaning my camel should be somewhere around here. But from what I can see, there's literally nothing. Even down here, there's nothing. But at this point, a thought popped into my head. Why if Thermite double cross me? This would mean Kipley and her gang of girls would be rushing towards me to take my remaining life. But I could use this to my advantage. But I first need to buy a bit of time, which is why I have this. A simple arcade machine. And inside my ender chest is a single heart, which is going to be completely up for grabs. Now, the reason I'm not redeeming the heart is because I need Kipley to take it. Because then by using a compass, I'll be able to track her location all the way to my camel. Now, I might be completely paranoid and they might not even be arriving. Meaning I've just wasted my time. There's a house right there. What is this? I think I see some name tags. Oh, look at him hiding. Oh, Hey there, man. No, no, keep him in there. Keep him in the corner. Keep okay, the corner. okay. Listen, 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 listen. You guys don't need to kill me. I won't ask how you found out about this. You're gonna have to do whatever we want now. You see that hole over there? You see this? Yeah, you can actually, you could win it by playing this game. By any chance, you guys have rabbit foot? I do. I'll, I'll take as many as you can. Uh, I have six. You could this. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, you, you guys kind of suck. Nah, this is rigged, man. Hey, just go grab the heart. We're getting out of here. Yo, you guys never win. Well, I can't really do anything. But worked like a charm. They were completely distracted with the machine that they didn't even think about why I'd have a heart laying around, especially on the wall. But now I have a compass, which leads to where they were actually going. I also managed to get seven rabbit's feet. So now if I check back at my sniffer, hey, yo, where's my sniffer gone? Oh, it's right there. Have I been gone for that? Oh, wait, I have rabbit's feet in my hand. Uh, that guy would have tried to kill me and I would have died. You're going to fight some people because I think I found the location of my camel, which I'm pretty sure is right there. But since Kipley has a whole army, I know there'll be a lot of guard, which is why I'm making a tunnel that leads from Thermite's house into Aves's. Now, if I rig it with redstone, it's going to lead into this room, which I'm going to cover with TNT. This is so I can frame Thermite and create tension within Kipley's group. It will also distract all the guards, making it easy for me to sneak in. And now, if I click this lever in Thermite's house, it should blow up Aves's base. <laughs> oh my, what the? Oh, that definitely blew up. Wait, someone was there to witness it. Okay, that worked out perfectly because that player will now report it back to Aves and they'll go to investigate it. Your house blew up and there's a tunnel leading what? to someone else's house. Thermite blew up Aves' base? Why do you blow my house? Okay, that's perfect. It definitely worked better than I thought. Oh my God. So Thermite Why blew up my house. This means three of the five gods are completely distracted, which means if I drink this invis now and just bring the sniffer close enough, it should lock on. They're watching, they're watching and back up because I don't want to deal with any of this. Who hatched this man? Yeah, go check him out, Toby. He's investigating. What the, Toby? Is it attacking you? Then it started with a sniffer. Okay, I'll help you. I'll help you. And it's still looking a heart, which I don't even care about at this point. Take that. My invis ran out. My invis ran out. Get away from him. Oh my god, he's going after you, man. My camel's right there. Easy. I got the- Hey, oh, what did I press? What is this diamond looking border? That I can't get inside. The pressure plates I ran over must have set off an alarm. Luckily, I still have my minecart and I hope this works. Please. Yes, I'm so smart. Wait, but the problem is, how do I get out? Either way, you're now mine. I finally acquired my pet, but they were about to arrive inside any minute. So I had to think of an escape. Now, how do I get you out? Because if I try to run outside the border, it'll just TP me back in for some reason. And I assume the same happens to you. Toby, the border has activated the alarm set up. Look at this a giant border in the sky. And I think any second these guys will be coming in. How do I get you out? First, I need to take this lead. Can I lead you? I think I can lead you out. Whoever activated it might still be here, all right? Look. Look around, look around. Wait, I think I see them. Are the outsides clear? Did you find anything? That might have been small. Toby, the camel's gone, man. They might think the camel's escaped and they'll shut down the border. Okay, just so I don't leave you, I need to first be able to get out. How'd they get the camel on the border? If I just place this here? Where have I been sent? What is this? Yo, there's only 26 left in the village. No, 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 no. They gotta be close. That, that would have taken a long time. Tell me we gotta find him. Meaning if it runs out, they'll realize the camel's still in there. And my entire escape failed. Well, my invis has run out, but I think the camel's still down there. There's a freaking minecart. I didn't put that there. Did you put that there? They're literally right there. And I'm right above them. They're not in the building. They're not around the building. We gotta go look outside. I think they're searching everywhere outside. Wait, it's right here. Come with me. We go the opposite way. I really hope this is the camel. But we've done it. But even though I've now rescued the camel, he's still one of the weakest mobs in Minecraft, who's able to be one shot by any player. Well, for now, I'm gonna leave you right here. But now I need a plan to make this camel the most of a powered pet ever. Now, for my plan to work, I need to head over to Thermite. That's because the girls believe he blew Aves' house. So he's currently on bad terms with them.
them. But he still has no idea that I know he double crossed me. Meaning I could use this to my advantage. I first need to make a little cage over here like this. That I won't be able to escape from. And if I block this up like this. He should perfectly spawn right here. And I'll be putting a rabbit's foot in each one with pressure plates. Uh, and now I'll need to find a way out. But when he dies, he'll spawn on top of the pressure plates. And my camel will keep killing him. Stealing all his hearts. Wait, quick. What are you doing in Thermite's house? Uh, I was kind of looking for him, but you should kind of work. Zetro caught me coming outside, meaning there's a witness to this entire scene. But I could use Zetro instead. Okay, Zetro, I have a deal for you. Well, what is it? Uh, I need you to raid Kipley's base. Wait, what? I will give you a god apple. All right, you've got yourself a deal. All right, good luck. It's just over there. Well, that guy's an idiot. Because no matter who actually goes, they're 100% getting caught. That's because Kipley lives in one of the most overpowered bases in Minecraft, with over 10 alarm systems. Did I also mention guards? Yeah, a lot of them. Meaning. Zetro will be completely caught and leak my entire plan. I know you blew up Abe's house, Thermite. And that's why I'm right behind this. I need to dig out a 5x5. Five five. I think someone like this should work. Well, what else have you been up to, huh? Are you the one that stole the camel? Now, for my plan to work, I need a fake camel. But it'll take me too long to actually find one. So instead, I need to find a substitute. Where's my camel? <laughs> what are you- Oh, you uh, uh, it too, buddy. Uh, uh, it out. And if I now just cover it with moss, I think I have barely enough. Doesn't this look natural? Oh. Guys, Kibli, hmm? I found Zetro in your base. Perfect timing. They must have caught Zetro. I know everything, buddy. And you aren't safe. Meaning they'll be searching the entire world trying to find me. I honestly think you might do. If I throw an invis potion on you and bring you back here, that looks like an invis camel. But if they just see an invisible mob, they won't find that strange at all. So I also need to use myself as bait. But that's why I'm messing Fermite. So I've told him I've stolen the camel and right behind the prison. So I'm gonna tell him I'm gonna be AFK for a bit so he can take it and hide it. Oh wait, Quiff just messaged me. Oh, did he, huh? How convenient. He said he had stolen the camel and he brought it behind the prison. All right, let him out. Meaning they're all gonna rush towards here. Now I have my last invis is here because once they get close enough before they can even hit me i'm gonna drop the trap just Break get out. him let's off go, the server i don't care if he's get afk him, man's gotta die so thermite is a double agent wait wait don't smash oh, the camel oh, no, 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 no. oh, oh my get out. yo get the corner get the corner they're all, they both died okay that, that worked out better than ever and i managed to get full netherite from that okay i'm kind of stuck i think the horse survived but i expected thermite to arrive because the trap was built inside his house but little did i know zetro's last spawn point was inside his bed wait what oh this <laughs> attacking me? This, yo, wait, this is where I spawn. Yo, yo, this is perfect. Wait, okay. Oh, Quiff, I literally, mate, I, I can't get out. Why yeah, is this camel just keep spawn killing me? What yep. am I supposed to do? Kind of sucks to be you right now, I can't lie. But Zetro was now being spawn camped by my camel. And all his hearts were being stolen until he had nothing left. And he's now disconnected. So you must be kind of overpowered now. If I was to test this, camels are already kind of overpowered. But one, two, three, four, five, ten. Okay, I almost could have killed you. I can't lie. But you know, I also managed to pick up three hearts on Zetro. So if I redeem them, I now have four hearts and a very overpowered camel. But the camel needs to be even stronger. And after learning they can stack netherite armor, it was time to make him immortal. Now you have full netherite, so you should be completely stacked. But why are there so many people at my house? Where's my camel? Okay, do you know what? Perfect time for you to sit down. Just stay there. So I kind of need to investigate this. Without me realizing, they completely swarmed my base. Hoping to find my camel. Now one part of this house can survive, people. Yo, wait, what? The, are these guys trying to blow up my base? Either way, I have an idea. And if I play this smart, I'm able to get a single kill. I just need to wait for someone to come out. Back up, buddy. Back up. Oh, oh my. Okay, wait, wait, wait. This is... My entire base is gone. Oh, wait, no, it wait, fell down. What? It fell down. Okay, wait, that, that, that messed up. That messed up. That messed up. We got a runner. Get him, get him, get him. Who has the pickaxe? Who has the pickaxe? Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Go, go, run, 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 run. Wait, how are these guys? Camel, camel. Oh, the camel. Oh, wait. Kill the camel. Wait, how? Wait, how? How did that die? Get him, get him. Why are they running back? No, the camel's in the area. That was the camel, right? But my camel completely died, which made zero sense. Unless Saucer swapped it out. You thought we killed your camel, huh? What does she want now? You thought we killed your camel? You did. We have your real camel. I will kill it if you don't show. If you want it, come to these cords. Well, that's kind of sus, because it's most likely they've left out a trap. It's either I find my camel and potentially die, or I arrive at the pet competition with no pet and be disqualified. Alright, I'm here. I'm here. Oh, uh, look who showed up. Oh, hey! Where is my camel? Yeah, he's down there. What do you mean down there? Don't, don't be no, scared. Ow. Whoa! Is that my camel? You know, take off your gear. Real? Oh my, okay, here. Is that actually my camel? I think we just have an infinite supply of camels around. What? What? Oh. No. Oh my! No! Someone kill him! 
Quiff, no. you shouldn't be up here. How oh. are you up here? <laughs> <laughs> Yo! Yo! Yo, these guys are actual bots. <laughs> Yo, I can't believe that worked. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. We run. We're almost back home. We're almost back home. Oh, no. We head all the way. We head all the way. I see oh, him. I see is. the camel. This way. This way. Come, come, come. Brother, 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 brother. You think some arrows are going to do anything, huh? Go, run, go, run, go, run. go, 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 go. I just want right. to talk. Give me your camel. Keep running. Okay, you took damage, but it's fine. Oh my, that trident. How's he still got a trident? I always have a trident. Keep running, keep running. Why? What am I? What am I stuck in? I don't have much time. How long till we pick competition? He can't survive forever. No. 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 <laughs> oh my. He's, he's a one tap. No. He's a one tap. No, 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 no. No. Oh, no, 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 no. Yo, yo, yo. Yo, yo, it's ended. It's ended. It's ended. It's ended. Hey. Relax, this is my camel now. But now we have to arrive at the arena and put the pets to the test. And I've arrived to the arena and everyone's already ready. They have iron golems, pandas, upside down dog. All right, everyone can place their bets now. I don't know who's going to win. Okay, everyone, we've had our disagreements, but uh, yeah, everyone can take a rabbit foot. There you go. Good luck. There you go. You guys can all take your Thank rabbit you. foot. Yeah. Uh, and I guess it starts. All right, go, 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 go. Oh, my God. All right, come on, iron go. Go get him. Go get him, buddy. Also, focus quick. Yeah. What, what, what did I do, yo? Is this is the pit. Do oh, one. Whoa, what? What? Why is the camel hitting me? Hello? Yeah, 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 yeah. Do okay. my camel. Whoa, 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 whoa. Do you think you're safe uh, over here, huh? In the corner uh, with your dog? Uh, oh. <laughs> the sniffer <laughs> died. Nah, he's gonna take you. Yeah, he, he's not gonna whoa, die. Whoa, whoa, whoa. guys, so guys. Weird. Guys, don't. Pivot, no! She's what? dead to the panda. Uh, not even the camel. Uh, oh. oh, my God. Oh, no. There's one more. You're not escaping either, oh. so I might. Uh. No, get him. Why is this dog after me? This dog's dead. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, no. <laughs> I just died. I must have picked up a rabbit's foot because this guy's after my life. Yo, I don't want to deal with this. But yo, he's chasing me. Yo, yo, I need to get him. Yo, I won the pet competition. I'm my camel's a mole.